Today, I'm in middle school science. I've done a lot of these videos. I've never actually been caught. It's come close. For reference, see substitute teacher caught on camera. I've been recognized. I got an email from another substitute teacher in the same district. He's a fan of mine. I speak for all substitute teachers. I am the voice of a generation of middle-aged male substitute teachers. I got discovered and nothing happened. Not only did nothing happen, the substitute teacher became a fan of mine. He subscribed. He likes me. He really likes me. Of course, the great fear is being caught by students. Eventually that'll happen and I'll lose all classroom control because why in the world should they listen to me when they know they could get me fired I don't know if I could really get fired for doing this but it's possible and I really need the money more than the fame I mean I gotta do things like buy socks fill up my car with gas eat food that doesn't cause gas eat pay for electricity buy more of these fancy vests and buy really fancy reading glasses now that I got recognized I find it kind of cool. I feel like the wacky neighbor next door on a sitcom. The pilot guy that used to come in on Newhart. Or Mrs. Kravitz on Bewitched. Like Kramer. Or Davy Jones on The Brady Bunch. Although he wasn't a wacky neighbor. He only appeared once. Because Marsha wrote him a fan letter. And he took her to the prom. Ah, Davy Jones. Or I could become famous like Fred Figglehorn. Yeah, YouTubers, I love Fred. Get over it. He's funny. And now he's got a TV show. Which is also funny. I look at awful lot like President Bush. I want to be as famous as Captain Kangaroo. Captain Kangaroo was my childhood hero. Actually, Mr. Green Jeans was my hero. Captain Kangaroo was just the host. I want to be as famous as the men's warehouse guy or the hair club for men guy because then I could get free hair club for men. Hair club. Like John Travolta. I want to be as famous as Kramer, but not for the really bad stuff. You know, for the funny stuff. Hey, Jerry. I could be like the guy looking over the fence in Home Improvement. That's the best way to be famous. No one ever knew what he looked like, so he could still go to Safeway or Walgreens. Can you imagine seeing Jerry Seinfeld in a Costco? If I get discovered for making these videos, I'll probably have to start delivering newspapers. I'll be one of those guys at four in the morning throwing newspapers out of their car. Or I could deliver yellow pages or do the census for the government. And it's gonna be really hard to be Mr. Sub without a classroom. I'll just have to make videos about cleaning the house, about how much I hate making my bed, videos of me paying the bills, videos of me videotaping myself. Whoa, total matrix, man. Thanks for following me, Mike the Sub. You've made me famous. I think I'm gonna have to be more secret. Shh. Don't tell anyone where I am. Life of a sub.